All right, guys, now I'm going to swap out the stock Bafang controller, the 30 amp controller, with our newly launched uh, 60 amp Torque X controller. It's been hot rotted. Um, it's plug and play with the old uh, Bafang, the BBSHD Bafang unit. So I'm going to show you how to swap it out. All right, I'm going to start out with removing these three bolts right here. So I have the three bolts removed. Now you just want to carefully take the controller out. So you want to be careful. There's a rubber gasket right here. So take it out slowly. Sometimes it rips while in the process. You don't want to do that. So you take out the phase wires, all three of them. And the sensor wire right here. And then so this one I've already, so this is the late rate limiting step. Usually there's silicone right here. So I've done this process before, but let me show you. Basically you just got to cut around the silicone right here on four, all four sides. And then the buttons on the inside, you press it. I usually use a cutter to press the button down so it releases. And then the old controller is out and that's it. And I'm going to switch it out with the new controller. So this is the Torque X controller. Same controller shape, everything, this is just plug and play. So same bolts that you took out. So I'm going to do the phase wires. Phase wires are in. So now I'll put the sensor wire. And then the hall sensor wire. All right, guys, it is installed. So now I just got to put the bolts on, plug it back in, connect the wires, and we are done. So I know my hand was in the way when I was installing it, so I just want to show you. So this is the green phase wire, the blue one, the yellow. This is the sensor wire, and this is the hall sensor, the white one right there. <laughs> 